ToyTractorTimes.com is here at the 2013 Lafayette, Indiana Farm Toy Show with Andy Willis. He has built a very impressive uh, 164th nighttime pulling display. So, would you like to give us a tour, Andy? I uh, I was just want to say that the the grandstand is really neat. Did that take a long time to build? Or? It take about it take about almost a week to make the grandstand. Get the bottom part, and then when you get the the top or the roof, you know, the top and roof part on. And then the harder part is to try to keep the water and like water and the light that. Yeah, it's um. It's really neat how you have lights all the way through the display. And now, I noticed this morning when you're sitting up, you have a lot of the sponsors and uh, like Lucas Oil signs and some of the other ones along the, the racetrack. And, I got them. Uh, I tried to make them one just like it. Uh, now I'll tell you, this is kind of the grooming and the packing here for the for the track. Now what do you use for your lights? Um, they, they look very realistic here along the both sides of the yeah. pulling track. It's just mm -hmm. on the crack the line. Mm -hmm. I use a uh, a white white out marker. It's some kind of a uh, some kind of dual white out too. Yeah, concrete pad and stuff. No. It's made out of about a uh, bio and like you put on wall for the kitchen. Okay. That looks just like concrete. And then the, I take these are all the markers, uh, the kind of little pylons along the track. Did you make all those? Or? And then uh, really impressed by all the semi trucks. Yeah. Oh, you put in there. Oh, the trailer is a special dark ass. I paint, you know, paint them all over and make it white. And you can see some of them. I've been putting details on it. 